In this video, I want to show you how to make a static front page for WordPress. By default, WordPress um, uses that the most recent blog posts to go on the front page of your website. So whenever you make a new blog post, it automatically appears on the front page of your website. But what you might want to do is to have a, a static page, which could be any page on your website. I'm going to make this servicing page uh, the front page. And then you can have a, a blog post button. So you cl click the button and it takes you to your blog posts. Anyway, the easiest way to do it is to watch as I go along. So what we need to do, first of all, we need an empty page and we're going to call that blog. So we go to our, um, our dashboard and we need to go to pages, add new, just going to, this, this is going to be a completely empty page we're going to give it a title of blog but that's all we're going to put into this page and then we're going to click publish so that's a page not a post and all we've put in it is the title if you go to the server there we go right now what we need to do now is to add that blog page to the menu bar so let's go to appearance menus and in appearance menus we want to add the, these are the buttons in the navigation bar we made, we made the navigation bar in the previous video um, but we're going to add just one page to it and that's the blog page so we just in this where it says pages just click the button that says blog and then click add to menu so we, we tick the blog box there and we clicked add to menu then we're going to save the menu just go to the server Right, so now we've got an extra button in there. So we'll have a look at our web page. And there's no, no blog page there now, but when we refresh the page, there we go, the blog button's appeared. But at the moment, that blog page is empty. There's nothing inside it. So what we need to do now is to set um, the, the page that opens as the front page, and we need to set which page is the blog page. So we're back in our dashboard and we need to go to settings reading now we'll, we'll, when we get to settings reading if you have a look here you can choose your latest uh, it says here front page displays and we can choose the latest posts or a static page so click the radio button that says a static page. Don't click the link, just click the radio button. And then for our front page, we can pick any page on our site. We can't pick a blog post in this way, but you can pick a page. So I want it to be the servicing page. So I'll click that. So front page is our servicing page. You can pick whichever one you want. And then the posts page, we'll choose that as blog. That's em the empty page we made and we called it blog. Right, this, this bit here says blog pages to show at most 10. That just means uh, there'll be 10 blog posts shown on each page. You can change that if you want to. So, we click the static page radio button, chose our front page and chose the blog page, the empty blog page. We click save changes. Right, now we want to go back to our website and see what it looks like. So this was the empty blog page before. So we've changed it now. So click the blog button and see if it's, there we go. We've got our most recent blog posts in there. And if we go to the front page, the, the start page of our website has now been changed to the servicing and maintenance page. So that's all you need to do. Well. Thanks for watching. I do hope you found that useful and I do hope you pop back. Bye.